Well, top of the morning to you lads and lassies, and pardon my fake Irish brogue here. Remember, imitation is the sincerest form of flattery. So please, no hate mail. Well, I went to the golf course today. I'm not a member of the golf course. It's, I just um, live somewhere near it. And I picked up... Well, I mean, I had some lunch over there, actually. It was the kind of roast beef on toast. Well, I finished the toast because I didn't want it to get all soggy. And I ate some of the roast beef, and I have the mashed potatoes and gravy and green beans. And I told them, please don't put any gravy over the roast beef. And I'm glad I told them to do that because it still was kind of... I mean, it was making the bread sort of soggy, and I hate soggy bread. Darn, I forgot my pepper. The well, thing is, you know, I I can't eat very much, and any time I go there, I always have to bring something back. And that's true any time I go out somewhere and have a meal, you know, which I'm usually with my wife now since she's retired. And then we divide things, or we get a kid's meal. I'm just not a big eater, which is kind of weird making food videos and not being a, a big eater. I moved into this room here, the formal dining room, which is never used for anything at all. So I was experimenting with, um, with um, dining over here. Why am I wearing a, a tie? Well, in my old videos, my food videos, like two or three years ago, I was sometimes wearing a tie. This makes it feel kind of good. Let's see how this is now. And it is very good. It was good at lunch. And it's good now for supper. So I hope you're all warm and happy and safe and healthy like a little puppy. dining table here is is so high I feel like I'm eating like this it's just really good mashed potatoes and gravy and I told uh, the young lady there at the at the um, counter tell them to please don't put any any gravy on the on the roast beef did I already say that? Am I repeating myself? Mm. So she said, do you want gravy on the potato? And I said, yeah, I wonder on the potatoes. And even then, I don't need a lot. You know, people put too many, too many gravies on everything. And it just makes it unappetizing to me. These people make the very best sweet potatoes. In fact, all the meals they have there are very good. However, I found out that the price went up today. It was like, before it was like five and a half dollars or seven dollars, and it came, it came with some iced tea, but I wanted to have some water. Depending on whether you were a golfer or not, well, I'm not a golfer. I'm not a member of the club. I just, sometimes I just uh, drive over there and have a, a little lunch or maybe just a little 
uh, sandwich of some kind. But now, but now you see the price. It was five and a half or seven, depending on you if you were a golfer. And now it's it's like seven and a half or nine. So the price went up. And the tea, the iced tea was like was like a two dollars for a little to go cup. And now it's I saw where it was three dollars. But the young lady gave me my drink for a dollar eighty five. I guess maybe it was no, it was um it was billed separately on the on the um the credit card on the receipt. So I thought maybe it was maybe it was part of the meal, but it was billed separately. So I'll be checking on that later. On the menu it says three dollars. These beans are delicious. The thing is, you see, they have a buffet on Tuesday. And it used to be $12. Well, it was $10 before the pandemic. And they went about almost two years with no buffet on Tuesday. And now it's, it's, um, it was $12 when they came back after the pandemic. And I was over there last week and now it's raised to, to nearly $13, like $12.96, something weird like that. But they have the best cooks. And they have the nice tablecloths in the main dining room. Nice white tablecloths. Makes you feel kind of special. But this is really good. And I'm taking too long. In fact, I won't even finish this meal right now. So don't worry, you don't have to sit here and watch me for the next 30 minutes eat all this. I'm gonna have to save it again. It's delicious roast beef. Something else. Uh, this is one of my work ties. I only have five left. And I forgot how to tie the real tie. And I didn't want to spend more time on it. So I just wrapped it around somehow. So it's really not, not, it's not properly tied. Not a bit. Can you all of this? I think I'm gonna have to say goodbye. Goodbye and, and good evening and and we'll talk again real soon. And you be careful out there and and take care and and I have such a great community that I just love you all as much as I can from the other side of the camera. So, good day.